Hi. Well, hello. I am coming to you this Thursday. Hopefully I caught you before you're going back to lunch, if you're on your lunch hour, um, because I'm, I'm kind of just frustrated. Um, I've been hearing a lot of client concerns lately, and I'm still trying to figure out how to go live on both platforms, so bear with me, Instagram, if I'm not looking at you, but just tune in, for, tune in with me for a little bit. I've been really frustrated with a lot of my clients right now because they're talking about calories all the time, and it is such crap. You guys, um, please stop. Let's talk about calories for one second, okay? So calories is this system that's super antiquated, okay? It's based in physics. So our bodies are physiological bodies. We have physiological processes. And our physiological processes are metabolic pathways like, we have all these different metabolic pathways like the Krebs cycle, glycolysis, all these sciencey things. But there's not one receptor site or one metabolic pathway that is triggered by calories in our body, right? So there used to be this trainer at my gym, God love him, but I have to tell you, it's driving me crazy because he used to say, calories are calories are calories. Calories in, calories out. All calories are created equal. You create a calorie deficit and you lose weight. I'm sorry. I'm just going to call bull on that. It is so not true. So if you're currently struggling right now and you're, you're struggling with losing weight, you feel like you're eating right, you feel like you're exercising correctly and you're eating clean and you're still not getting weight loss, it might be because you're not eating the right types of foods that kind of you know, elicit the type of response in your metabolic pathway that you want to elicit so that you can get the result you want. So I'm going to ask you to do me a favor today and stop counting calories. You guys, just when you go to the store and you look at something, please don't look at the calories. In fact, you shouldn't be eating things with you know lots of labels on them anyway. But if you are, don't look at the calories. Think about how that metabolic response will help your goals or hinder them. So hormones are the key to keeping our bodies healthy, lean, strong, and youthful. And they're also the key to keeping your weight down for life. So if you're having a struggle right now, where you're just not able to lose those extra 10 pounds or whatever that looks like, and especially if you're over 40, you've really got to pay attention to hormone balance. So if you want more information on that, I'm going to be doing a live video tomorrow in my private Facebook group that's open. It's free. Um, it's called Thrive Tribe at 9.30 a.m., and I do it every week. It's called Fitness Friday, and I'm going to be talking a lot about hormones and a very special hormone that is really the key to our lasting health metabolically and keeping our bodies lean and satiated and feeling good, which is called leptin. So the secret sauce in being lean and staying lean and healthy is leptin. And if you are um, currently not knowing what to do and how to eat properly or how to nourish your body, this video will really help you. And this live chat tomorrow that we're going to do is really going to help you. Hi, ladies. Hi, Lori. Hi, Colleen. Hi, Mare. So if you guys have ever had issues around losing those last five or 10 pounds, just pop on over tomorrow and listen to this talk. It'll really help um, kind of put some things in perspective. And I'll give you some tools and techniques to start implementing right away so you can start to balance those hormones and change the way your body metabolically processes food. Okay. All right. I will see you guys tomorrow. Hopefully I will pop the link here for Instagram and for Facebook on where to join my um, Thrive Tribe so that you can listen to my Fitness Friday video tomorrow at 9.30 a.m. Mountain Standard Time. Okay, guys. I hope you have a great Thursday. And if this video is helpful to you, you might want to let me know here. Also, you can go to my YouTube channel because I have an awesome video there on insulin and that hormone. So if you're interested in learning about that, pop on over there and you'll learn all about that insulin hormone in a very easy to understand way. I give you visuals, so hopefully it'll make sense to you. Okay, guys, have a great day. Bye. Bye, Instagram.